That's just a little bit more definition, which will look beautiful in photographs. And it's the width of the brush that makes lining like that so easy. Because you literally just lay it down. Now I'm going to take my number 76 brush and I'm going to wipe off that powder. And as you can see, it just brushes away that shadow that I dripped. So now I have a clean area underneath the eye. Now I'm going to take my number 13 brush and I want to create subtle de definition but gradation of color. I'm going to take my mid-tone, look up, and we go right along that lash line. I'm then going to take my accent color, my garnet color, and go right over it as well. Creating that subtle definition. I'll then take my number 14 brush, take my highlight shade, highlight the inside corner, along the lower lash line. Okay, so now I'm going to do a layer of mascara. Look down for me. Because we all know I love my lashes. Or her lashes. Let's do a quick layer. Top and bottom. This is my second layer on top. Now I am going to use a waterproof mascara on the bottom because she's so, just so darn happy she's going to cry or might. Look up. So I always think it's best with bridal to use waterproof. And if you really think she's going to cry a lot, I could go over my top layer with waterproof as my third layer and that would waterproof no matter what formula I used on top. Now, as I said, with this time of day, some of the pictures will be being taken with a flash. And so, colors to the skin.